From there, what we do, what we, call, we do something called hockey footy. It's a, uh, a stick work drill, two men per ball, sometimes three with the odd man, and just rolling the ball out. And those two or three kicking it, goosing it to themselves, picking it up and throwing the ball backhanded. This is a simple little thing to do that is allowing us to play at a more sophisticated, crafty level with our stick work as defensemen. You know, we don't always have time fundamentally to just pick up a ball. We've, we've got to goose it to ourselves, get it to the open space and go make a play. We don't always have time to pick up the ball all right, and throw it overhand. This is a chance for us to pick it up side, you know, and lateral it to each other. And so the hockey footy is a phase that we do almost every day. Again, trying to make our defensemen a little more crafty with their stick work. Better speed, better pace, let's go. Next, uh, corner ground balls. You know, for us, what we do here is we create three men in a line. The first man and the third man are together. And what you're seeing us do on the field is, even though it's not truly the corner of the lacrosse field, we're using a restraining line and a sideline, we're treating this corner as the corner of the field. I've got a bunch of balls. One, two, three. One and three are together. I roll a ball into the corner, and num defenseman number one has a clean shot at it with number two on his back, and number three talking to number one about what he should do with that ball. We also have an outlet way up here. This is a chance for number three to communicate to number one what to do with that ball. If number three thinks number two is too close for number one to pick it up cleanly, we use the term goose, goose left, goose right. And you'll see examples when we go through the practice of number one, not even trying to pick up the ball cleanly, he may just kind of scoop it temporarily and push it to space as a ground ball. Or he may actually temporarily pick it up and backhand flip it to space to number three, wherever number three is communicated to him, left or right. Uh, number three can also say you, you, you. And that's saying you pick up the ball. I'm, and in that case, he's saying number two isn't close. You just go ahead and pick up that ball. And so it's a, it's a little drill that we like to do, again, working on the communication when you're in traffic and there's people checking you. A long stick, it's hard to always pick up a ball clean with a six foot stick, you know, and using it and getting that thing to space. Good. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Good. Throw it. Oh, that's it, Cooper. I like that, Cooper. Uh, Ambrose, just say then just, you got to make the UUU call there. If he cheats it or somebody else shows up, just give the UUU call. Okay, and then he picks it up himself. Here you go. Hey, goose left, goose left, whip. Good. Get, get rid of it. Blue ready? Go, Greco. Goose right, Greco, goose right. Nice play, Jared. That's what he tied up the backhand, Jared. Good left tail. Goose left, goose left, goose left. And run through it, and run through it. Good. Keep talking. Keep talking to that third. Keep talking. All right, 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 right. Good. Yeah, again, you could say you. If, if somebody can pick up that ball clean, say you, 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 you. Nice, nice job, Ambro. Hey, goose right, goose right. Good. Keep it in. Get rid of it. All right. Nice job. Good work, Jared. 